PPD. My name is Charles Johnson, and I'm giving testimony as to help with why we should get rid of crack in North Omaha. And one of the reasons why is I've lived in um, 5904 Kingston Drive, and I'm 54 years of age, and at a young age, I was uh, affected by lead poisoning. My father did roofing, and also my mother was a nurse. Uh, and for the extra money, my father used to drive a friend down milk, scrap metal for lead, and he sold it. But at that time, he didn't know the smell that we was, we was smelling was, um, it, it affected us when we were inhaling it. And where it was, it did, um, made me sick. And at the age of two, I started taking vitamins, and I was uh, diagnosed with seizures. And my parents went to a specialist, and they told me that. So, I, I was, because of this lead, it happened. And I'm telling this story because I know for a fact that uh, exposure to lead and other toxins are affected the brain. In other words, they call brain damage and uh, other problems. While OPD, <coughs> North Omaha <coughs> plant may not admit they a high concentration that I smelled when my father was uh, burning this lead with a smoker. Um, but at the same time, when he did that, I had a problem with the seizure and stuff. And so therefore, uh, I'm telling you my story for a reason that you know how the seizures, how uh, toxic waste can affect us in any way. And so therefore, the high conditions of this lip, the lead and stuff like that, but slowly and continue, consistently uh, the lip. And the residents of home who lived there all their lives are exposed <coughs> to this uh, um, waste, and it can be dangerous. We already seen high asthma and combative uh, rates, uh, cardiovascular rates. And um, for North Omaha neighbors, and, at, at, and this plant only adds to this problem. So we're trying to find a better solution and a healthier way to get our power. Okay? And so North Omaha coal plants lift over 250 pounds each year. And the mercury makes its way to the waterway and gets into the fish, and then the consumers, us humans, eat that fish. Okay? Mercury can cause the effects on humans. Uh, you know, birth effects. And so, we should, as much as we have had, as epilepsy as, um, as lead poison has made with me. So therefore, uh, this plant that emits over two, uh, over thousand tons of sulfur dioxide and adds to the high asthma rates. My point is this: after every after everything we know about this plant and it's bad and how bad it is, how can we in good faith? continue to let North Omaha pollute. North OPPD should work with the community to develop a plan <coughs> to shut down the North Omaha station. The health risk is too high. We can find better ways to provide power. OPPD should invest in healthier uh, and uh, healthier and higher wind and solar. We should be leading our nation, not following it behind. We know better than that. What we're saying here is that we understand that we have the power. We know that it's kind of hard to get this kind of uh, change over. But if we don't change over soon, some of the kids you will see in the, fish in the future, just like with me in the 1960s when it was burning lead and my father was smoking that lead and the smoker and stuff like that, having lead poison at the age of two. So it caused me to have serious problems with epilepsy. You know, and, and this um, thing here, this coal plant, it can cause brain deficiency and brain damage. You may not see it right now, but eventually it will come out and the people will have to deal with this problem. Because the problem here is that when you deal with toxins like lead, and with um, coal, they do eventually over a period of time will uh, eventually um, um, cause brain damage. And uh, we know that they cause health problems, cardiovascular, and asthma and stuff like that. But they also cause brain damage to kids that smell that stuff. And also, if you do want babies, they're not born parents or working in those plants or around those plants. 
by inhaling that, eventually, it will cause problems. Thank you for doing that. Thank you.